There are some things that once you've seen them, you can't unsee them. Nope. And Lethal Company in VR is the epitome of that concept. Are all three of us on this bridge? We're about to crash this bridge. No! Oh! Oh, no! This is a free mod that I installed less than an hour after it went live. I took a screenshot because I thought it was funny. And after two clicks and restarting my game one time, I was in Lethal Company. For some reason he thinks- I'm dead. I don't think you're dead, Mike. You're talking. This was bound to happen eventually, but Lethal Company has been out for less than three months, and already someone has figured out how to put it into VR. Group hug. I don't it's been fun, gentlemen. That is right up there with the moon landing, as far as I'm concerned. There's AAA developers who don't move that fast, and they get paid. Cannot be oh. used in VR. What? Oh, it can! <laughs> <laughs> and it's a really good fit for VR, unlike some other VR adaptations, because there's a lot of equipment and communication in Lethal Company that benefits from having your hands free. All right, bad news, gang. Um, I heard something as soon as I opened the door. I don't know what it was, but there's definitely something in here. Hey, Mike, where'd you go? Mike? Oh no. Oh no. Uh, we don't need it. I know where he is. Yeah. Can you repeat that? Corey, he's dead. He's he's very dead, Corey. Come look at the floor. I lost the will to live. Holy god! Oh. Okay, all right. Time to go. And it's crazy how normal everything looks. You'd think downgrading your eyes to PlayStation 2 graphics would be jarring, but it's really not. I mean, it does work for this game. Even in VR, it works. I know. I was kind of surprised at first. The only noticeable difference is that everything feels huge in VR. God, that's a tall building. Wow. My headset's falling oh, off. Yeah. And as of very recently, I have three friends now with VR, so we could make a full VR lobby. Mike is hitting the gritty. <laughs> but Mike and I decided to play just the two of us while we were waiting for them. And Lethal Company in VR with only one other person is straight up terrifying. The scale is crazy. It's so I, much the bigger. It's gonna be so much scarier if he's like six four behind me. Yeah. Oh, it is so dark. This sucks. This is not gonna be fun at all. Oh wait, I actually don't like this. Mike, look down the hall. Yeah. You see it? We um we need to go. And we're gonna have to stare at it like with our faces now. We can't break real eye contact with it. Uh, you keep eye contact. It's eight feet tall at least. <laughs> yeah, this sucks. Okay. Um where are you going? If you uh, leave me right. like this, I swear to God. Here's the way out. All right, all right. Can I the doors? You, you oh. just closed it. You closed yourself in there. Oh my oh. God. Oh my God. <laughs> Mike, I'm opening it for you. <laughs> okay. Well, this is, this is ruined. And even with three people, it still makes the unavoidable jump scares 10 times as potent. Perfect. Oh, someone already made it back. Cool. Oh! But it's worth it when you're using the flashlights or talking into a walkie-talkie or spraying spray paint. Whoa. God damn it, something in there. <clears throat> what do you mean? I don't see nothing. Oh, 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 we need to go. 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 Okay, I'm bleeding. Um, yeah, they're dead. Just gonna go ahead and uh, mark this. VR is an experience enhancer, so the scary is more scary, but the fun is more fun, and the jetpack is more jetpack. It literally says this item cannot be used in VR. It, it, it can't. Like, you can't what? control it. Oh, okay, I've got it. You can use it. You hold trigger and then Am left joystick it? does stuff. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. I don't think he's alive. The 
only drawback in VR is the computer is harder to use since you don't have a keyboard. But this mod works with non-VR people too, or as I like to call them, scum. And you can just make them use the computer for you. Incoming signal. Now imagine if you were watching Family Guy. Big peanut. Big peanut. Big peanut, really. Big peanut. Good job, Mike. I've played a lot of Lethal Company. I've been streaming it every Tuesday on Twitch. I've been playing it offline with friends as well. This game was good enough without VR. I literally cannot. But this mod could not have come at a better time because I just watched a two hour long lore breakdown of this game and there were so many new gadgets I wanted to try. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how does a zap gun work in VR? No, not that. What are you doing? Whoa, oh, 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 oh! No, no, I'm sorry, I'm trying to zap it! It was good times, it was really good times. I feel very grateful to the person who made this mod because I should be too stupid to even have this. Oh no, oh no. Oh! What? There's a lot of VR conversion mods out there that require both a sketchy download and a manual install process that I can never figure out. This is why I still haven't tried out that Subnautica VR mod that everyone keeps throwing at me. Do you have music playing in the background on the ship? I have the blue box going. Okay, if you could turn off. Whoa. Yep, up, 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 up. That scared me. I thought I wasn't going to make that for a second. You got I this. I want to try this. You got this. Whoop. Oh my god. <laughs> Life is fragile. If you are one of the smooth brains who watches these videos the day that I upload them, I am streaming VR Lethal Company at two o'clock today. I've been told I make for great background noise if you have any chores to do. Uh-huh. <gasps> Hello, my friend. Moose. Moose. Hey, what's up, buddy? There's a Where spider. There's a big spider. I'm in VR. It's f***ing terrifying. Where are you at? Let me, let me look at it. It's right in front of me. It was moving. I don't know why it's not moving. Oh, Someone subbed and I completely here. missed it. Ball. Well, listen. I, I'll, uh, I'm kind of, I'm kind of screwed. I'm getting pinned. Yep. Um, oh. I'm going to go around. No. And I'm going to leave you there to die. No, 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 Moose. Moose. But for everyone else in the future... That's basically it. Although I do have to honor the ancient blood oath that I made years ago real quick, so be right back. It's a hot, it's fast, ninja, G. And the ball woman now. I almost didn't remember that there was once a ball man. If I didn't remember that, this would be ridiculously confusing. Stop it. Get some help. So yeah, it's been a good week. Whoever you are out there, I hope you've had a good week as well. If you're still here, thank you for the privilege of your time. There are some big things cooking behind the scenes right now. And before those happen next month, I just want to say... Thank you again for putting me in this position, and I want to make sure you know I don't take the privilege of your time lightly, even though my content oftentimes looks like this. <laughs> Mike. Mike. <laughs> this has to stop. But I've been your host, Sigurd, and if this is the last time that you hear my voice, have a good rest of your life, Traveler. But if our paths do cross again next week, then I will see you at the company store. Goodbye. There we go. Okay. How do you transmit? What? What? Why? Why? Okay, okay, okay. Tell me when. Tell me when. You idiot. Are you dead? Corey, tell me when. Corey? What is that? What the hell is that? 
It's a giant. Alright, we're, we're gone. We're out of here. Corey's dead. We're out of here. Bye-bye. Jeepers creepers, guys. This was a disaster. How did, how did it get this bad?